How's it going? I'm Sean Robinson. I'm with Panasonic Lumix and the marketing guys. So here we have the uh, uh, recently announced, uh, not at this show, but a little bit earlier this year. This is the GX885. Uh, um, the GX85 was uh, basically it's a little bit, little brother to the GX8, which was announced last year. Um, this camera brought a lot of um, substantial updates from the GX8 um, in in the the sense that. We went to a five-axis magnetic stabilizer with this camera, and we we upped our dual IS system with this camera. So what that means is that the five-axis symbody magnetic stabilizer is always active. You're always seeing it in the preview of the screen, no matter whether you're actually taking the picture or not. But it'll also sync in with our optic stabilization and give you around four stops stabilization, uh, effectively out over over uh, rounds. I think around 200 millimeter. So the GX885 was really kind of designed to be a little bit more compact, a travel-friendly uh, Micro Four Thirds camera with a 16 megapixel sensor with the low-pass filter removed, uh, and and be something that can really fit in a pocket, travel well, and deliver some of the higher-end uh, image quality that we've we've started to deliver with a lot of our other cameras. Um, the camera is capable of recording 4K video. Uh, with basically no record limit. Uh, the, the camera will record until either heat stops it or you fill up a card. Uh, it has our 4K photo, our post focus and focus stacking. Uh, it has a fully integrated touch screen in the back of it with an, our flip out tilt screen as opposed to some of the rest of our models which have a fully articulating screen. And basically is, is sized and weighted perfect for some lighter gimbal work, some drone work, uh, and, and like I said, just some compact travel work. If you want something that's compact, you can travel with it, throw it in a, in a jacket pocket and just you know not really realize it's there and just, just focus on taking pictures.